Every day taking trips, all my ladies love this. Check my bling. I ride fly on my plane sky high. It's a thug's high. Welcome back to Celebrity Scene News. I'm Pete Allman. We're here in Beverly Hills and uh, have a special gentleman today that we're going to talk to who's the founder and the creator of WTV and more importantly has a wonderful acting career along as being a publicist and a number of other things. And that's Mr. Eric Zuli. Eric, welcome to the show. Thank you for uh, having me, Pete. Well, you know, I'm excited about what you're doing because years ago when TV started, it, it started uh, on a very basic operation with big cameras, and from there they went digital, and it started with ABC, NBC, CBS, and now you've got your own network, but it's much more than a network. Explain that to us. Well, to go off what you're saying, you know the gentleman that actually created the TV, the television set, never got the credit. So always make sure that you get your patents and your trademarks and everything. Just a little note from Easy. Um, as far as my network, man, I, I just I, I like to help a lot of people. I created an, an entity and I just networked and, and met a lot of different people to open doors for a lot of people, and it just grew and grew. And WTV, the whole concept of it is what you need to know to succeed your goals. And um, you know, we do a lot of red carpet coverage, behind the scenes of music videos. We work with a lot of charities, uh, animal charities, and organizations, and cancer foundations, and things like that. And um, you know, it's just growing, and uh, great doors are opening, and we're walking through them. <laughs> when somebody comes to you and they say, "I need a press release, and I need the world to know about what I've got in this invention or my new record," uh, can you just press the button and it just gets out there? How do you how do you get that press release out there? Well, with being in the industry for about five, six years now, um, I'm the owner of our public relations firm, Gith Public Relations. Uh, I, I delegate it to um, go to the appropriate entities based upon what the press release is about. But we have a database that's pretty, pretty dramatic. It's definitely well over 20 million. And... Um, we just press the button. <laughs> well, base. I gotta give a, 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 a lot of love to uh, C4C Media. They created a program specifically for us to be able to do it. So it's kind of like Constant Contact and all them out there. But we got our own thing. It's our own program. So press the button. So here we are. You're a young man, as known as Easy in the business. Uh, as an actor, as a talent, yeah, Easy. And at the same time. In doing this uh, as an actor, and you could also be a rapper because you have a gift of rapping, the whole dance, or the whole thing. But uh, you have a different point of view than other public relation firms. I'd like you to go in detail on that. Well, um, you know, WTV is is a network that I've created, and I've been building for about four years, and it's a in-house media outlet for. GIF, which stands for Global Independent Talent Help, for GIF Public Relations. So it shows the proof of what we're able to do. Um, yeah. Ah, yes, it's on the YouTube, right? Yeah, we have a, a YouTube-based channel where YouTube partners, Google partners, and uh, you can go to whatyouneed.tv, check it out, wtvonline.net, click on videos. You can Google it. A lot of times now, if you Google celebrities' names, it's going to pop up. Uh, a lot of entities uh, like Expose and um, other people in Japan, and we're finding a lot of people are grabbing it from the channel, and uh, people call me up saying, I saw you on this, I saw you on that. I mean, I'm going in diners and people going, oh, you're that host, you're the interview guy, you interviewed Akon, you interviewed someone. And so I'm like, yeah. So it's it's working. You um, just did a commercial. It's a, a, a commercial for cologne, I believe it was. It was a, a limo axe rod, I believe it's called body axe body, body spray. spray. Axe body spray. You see, it's your, your, your Ralph's near you, and Lucky's, and Savons, and CVS. I mean, it's all over. Axe. Well, look at a little bit of that commercial. Uh, talk about the limo and how they split it in half and you went to Buenos Aires for that as I understand yeah they flew us out to Argentina we filmed in uh, Uruguay and um, I was the music star in the commercial I was the guy with the girls and uh, we get into a limo and we're having a good time and I'm rapping in it and all of a sudden it splits in half gives me whiplash and the girls go flying towards the guy that has the axe body spray and they put me in the rocks over off the pier you know? but the whole premise of it is you know the music star it is a gr great fragrance so you gotta check it out it smells great I mean it's it's a new product that they're doing and it's it it's giving back what the music stars have taken away from you you know that's the whole thing so it brings you the hot girls it brings you all the stuff that, that was that 
they feel that the music stars might have taken away with you. So that's the the whole point of the commercial, and it's really funny. It's it's different. I cut my I cut my hand while I was uh, filming the commercial. I had a piece of glass get stuck in my hand while I was doing it. I don't think you could see that right from here, but <laughs> it's a little bitty one. Yeah, well, actually, it wasn't a little bitty. It was about that that big of a piece of glass that stuck in my hand, and I was still filming while it was stuck in my hand because I pushed on the glass. It was crazy.